Boeing suffers. A dog detached from an Alaska Airlines Boeing 77 MAX shortly after takeoff in the US, terrifying landing in Turkey by for FedEx Boeing 767 without front landing gear, emergency landing for Air France Boeing 787-900 aircraft after cabin overheating, Boeing 737-300 ran off the runway during takeoff from Senegal. United Airlines 737 returned to the airport minutes after taking off from a Japanese airport. All these incidents in a matter of four days. Wheels come off, doors come off, cockpit, windows crack, engine brakes, rudders break, flaps don't work. Bolts loosen. Apparently, the problem has nothing to do with Boeing, but with Boeing itself. The Boeing company has been following an operational model for quite a long time, which has nothing to do with the company that the world knew 20 years ago. The company that was an exemplar company a few years ago is now in big trouble. Many problems are evident in the production, its finances and the way it manages the new aircraft models. Boeing itself went to FAA and literally surrendered, admitting that multiple complaints that at its Charleston, South Carolina plant for years, employees in charge of production inspection quality falsified forms. A former quality inspector at Boeing's biggest supplier told the BBC that aircraft fuselages often left factories with serious problems. A whistleblower from Spirit Aerosystems, Boeing's subcontractor for the outer skin of aircraft, reported that he was used to finding 50 to 100 or 200 defects in aircraft fuselages. I was finding lots of bent parts, sometimes even missing parts. They just wanted the product shipped. They didn't care about the consequences of sending fuselages in bad shape. They were focused on meeting the schedule and the budget. If the numbers were good, the condition of the fuselages didn't matter, he stressed. Another engineer who kept discovering many problems in the construction of the 787 Dreamliner and delayed the delivery was removed from the particular type of aircraft and put in control of the 777 aircraft, in which he found an even more significant number of problems. Three out of four commercial aircraft models currently manufactured by Boeing are officially under investigation by the US Civil Aviation Administration, FAA, including the 787 Dreamliner, which has a history of 30 accidents from 2014 to date. So, if you are planning uh, your next trip journey and it includes a Boeing aircraft, I don't know guys, you probably should be worried about that. I will check, uh, no, we travel to Computex, I think we, no Boeing is involved there, only Airbus aircrafts. It's a big, it's a very, very big pity. It's a big shame to see such a company like Boeing who uh, made some of the best airplanes that we know to be in such huge trouble because they went greedy. It's very, very bad. That's all guys, bye bye.